Hi, it's week three of the NFL, and that means week three for NFNL picks. Uh, this is the show where we pick the Steelers, Browns, and Bills. Uh, those are regional teams from around Erie. Also a lock pick and a toy cost. Uh, we call it NFNL picks because there's no effing lines, just winners and losers. Uh, you just got done watching uh, Josh Allen uh, run one in uh, in the uh, Bills win over the Jets. Uh, this week the Bills get the Bengals at home. Um, as you saw there, Josh Allen uh, working out pretty good. He had one on the ground, two in the air this week. Um, also, you had uh, uh, Devin uh, Singletary uh, taking one of those passes in for a touchdown. Also, Frank Gore adding to his uh, massive list of touchdowns over his career. Uh, Sean McDermott's got to be pretty psyched. This team is playing well. They are playing defense, defense defense they've given up only three touchdowns so far this year uh, that's very good and that's very bad for uh, uh, Mixon and the Bengals uh, Mixon has 27 yards on the ground all year uh, 700 yards in the air for uh, uh, Dalton um, their defense the uh, Bengals defense is a sieve uh, they've given up three on the ground so far five in the air uh, get your wings ready Buffalo yeah, that's right. I'm taking the Bills. In stride, OBJ. He comes back to MetLife and does this. How about it? Odell Beckham Jr. 89-yard touchdown. All right, well, that was Odell Beckham turning on the Jets against the Jets and the Browns win against uh, New York in New York uh, this week they're at home on primetime against the Rams uh, that should be quite an interesting uh, matchup uh, Baker Mayfield playing a much better game uh, last week uh, he, he looked pretty good Odell Beckham was outstanding with over 160 yards uh, um, Chubb they need to get him more involved um, their defense uh, stacked it up uh, they kept Bell to uh, very few yards and uh, low score um, also, Kitchens just had to love the fact that he was able to roast his former head coach's defense. Um, but this week he gets Sean McVay uh, and the uh, Rams. That means taking on Goff. It means taking on uh, Gurley. That could be tough. Uh, also, uh, their air game is uh, quite good. Um, they have balance with their receivers. Uh, their defense is uh, stuffing uh, teams up. Uh, it's uh, tough to get any running yardage. Uh, they are giving up no touchdowns on the pass, getting to the quarterback. Um, yeah, I know that the uh, dog pound is going to be barking in prime time, but I'm taking the Rams. All right, well, that was Mason Rudolph throwing his uh, oh first goodness. touchdown of his career in Pittsburgh. Uh, as the 0-2 uh, Steelers go to the 2-0 uh, San Fran 49ers this week. Uh, first thing to say, Ben is out for the season. He is having uh, elbow surgery. Won't be seeing him at all this year. Uh, and that brings us to Mason Rudolph, who uh, looked pretty good through two touchdown passes. Uh, ran for a first down. The line is going to have to protect him if they're hoping for anything out of the young QB. Uh, the defense looked pretty good early. They got to the quarterback uh, quite a few times in that game against Seattle. They picked up uh, uh, Fitzpatrick uh, from the Dolphins. That should help their uh, defensive backfield, hopefully. Um, but they need to get their tackling together. They looked uh, horrid tackling the ball. Uh, and if they don't tackle the uh, San Fran Braid, this guy, 5.9 yards per carry right now. Uh, Jimmy G is looking good out there. Um, they really haven't played anyone. They put up 41 and 31 against their two opponents, though. Uh, their defense has uh, just given up 17 points per game. Uh, that's in the middling. Uh, my real question about Mason Rudolph, though, is do we call him Mace or do we call him Rudy? I'm not sure. Do I believe uh, the Steelers can win this game? I'll put it this way. I want to believe. 
So, yep, I can't help myself. I'm taking the Steelers. We are from that town with the great football team. We cheer the Pittsburgh All right, our next Steelers. game is the lock of the week. Uh, this we week's lock is the... Uh, 0-2 Miami Dolphins at the 2-0 Dallas Cowboys. That's right. Uh, Fitzpatrick is out. Rosen is in. Uh, this defense has given up over 100 points in two games. Uh, and they got to go against Dak, Zeke, the boys, in Jerryland. Yeah, that's right. I'm taking the Cowboys. All right, and the last pick is the uh, coin toss this week. Coin toss game is the uh, Monday night game. Uh, it's the 1-1 Bears going to uh, the 0-2 uh, Redskins. Uh, heads is the Bears. Tails is uh, Redskins. Uh, as usual, we're going with the Steelers coin. Uh, the logo is the heads. Uh, the script logo is tails. So let's see what we get here. All right, there it is. And we have... Heads. Heads it is again. That's the third week in a row. Keep flipping heads. That means uh, we are getting the Chicago Bears. The Chicago Bears for uh, this week's uh, coin flip. Uh, I really want to thank everyone for watching. Uh, you can like, share, subscribe on YouTube. Um, love you to share it even on Facebook or Twitter. Um, and I just want you to uh, enjoy these videos. And remember, when it comes to the NFL, it's just an effing game.